Hey, how you doing guys? Uh, just wanted to wish you a happy uh, New Year's. Uh, of course, 2018. This is January the 1st. Uh, I'm doing this video. Um, now, this video is going to cover um, a topic. Now, recently, a company called OWC or Other World Computing, they sell um, Mac computers, um, upgrade kits for them, uh, and they even do their own upgrades for you turnkey solutions as well as uh, Mac merchandise for your Mac and recently they did a breakdown of the new iMac Pro and they did find some very interesting things now uh, one of the things they noticed was um, it does use quad channel RAM slots so um, it is even though it's not user upgradable you can take it to an authorized Apple service center to replace or simply when you configure it um, you probably may want to use the highest RAM you can afford. Um, now, oh, oh yeah, all four RAM uh, for the 32 gig model, all four RAM slots were filled. So if you want to go to 64, you're going to have to replace all four modules, unfortunately. Now, what's the most interesting to me is uh, for the SSD drive, they're actually using two, which is rated together in RAID 0 configuration. But they are socketable, or they are socketed, and so they are replaceable. Now, um, I've been looking on the internet, and there's uh, some people don't like the fact they're using two SSD drives rated together. For one thing, they're saying um, Apple's cheaping out rather than using a single one tetrabyte drive. Uh, they're actually using two uh, 512 gigabyte drives. Now, uh, and then another thing they're saying RAID 0 is unreliable to use as a main drive uh, for a computer. Um, as far as cheaping out, anytime uh, a company tends to use RAID 0 as their main drive, it's not for cheaper prices. It's usually for higher access speeds and actually RAIDing together um, SSD drives is becoming much more common. In fact, OWC themselves couple years ago uh, sold their own version of a SSD drive in which they put two SSD drives in a PCIe card which you put in your slots uh, which is much faster than going through your SATA connections for uh, traditional hard drives and then which they rated uh, use rated uh, RAID 0 to uh, you know make much faster access speeds now when um, SSDs first came out, um, they were notoriously unreliable because they were new, the technology wasn't fully developed like it is now. Uh, nowadays that's almost totally flip-flopped and um, SSDs are uh, becoming actually more reliable than even mechanical hard drives of past. So uh, using them in RAID 0 configurations should be more than doable. And in fact a lot of professionals tend uh, when they uh, purchase a, com uh, a new computer for their main drive they'll just put on the applications and operating system and then they keep their data on a secondary hard drive either internal or ex external now the reason for doing this is often when they're trying to get uh, access large amounts of data on the same drive as your operating system that tends to slow down performance because your computer often needs also access to uh, operating system files at the same time so that tends to slow down performance um, another thing is they're saying uh, um, um, another thing as far as data itself um, if you do st uh, store your operating system and applications only on the main drive, then you really need to think about backup as well. Um, and of course, for even storing data on a separate drive. So um, I tend to, I have two Mac Pros. Uh, one is a SSD model. The other one uses conventional mechanical drives. And I have a time machine on both of them. Um, mostly only on the operating system application drives. Um, the other ones aren't as critical. And I tend to store my video files on the chips, the memory chips themselves. So I, that's going to be my backup in that case. So give me your thoughts on uh, Apple using rated zero uh, SSG drives as the main drive. You think that's a good idea? Um, 
is it going to be more prone to failure? But uh, I think nowadays it's not an issue. But uh, give me your thoughts on that. And uh, till then, have a great uh, New Year's.